Well, here we are at Dordoin Sport Adventure. Uh, start of the first day. We're all out in the car park, fitting all the road book readers, getting ourselves set up for, for the off. So my bike's got mine, got mine installed. Got ready to go. Lots of people and lots of bikes. I right, stopped in the middle of the countryside for um, a lunch break. Nice morning of day two, about eight o'clock in the morning, getting the bike out ready before breakfast. Done a great job yesterday. All pretty muddy. Didn't have too much mud, but um, not as much as Normandy, but what mud we have is uh, plenty deep. Did a great job. It's still the beginning of day two, we come out to get ready, put the road books in, and it's chucking it down with rain. So not a good start to today. Slight unscheduled stop on the trail. <laughs> Joe's run out of fuel, so we've uh, stopped to tip some out of uh, Sam's bike. Trust the old Honda. Fuel tanker. There's a reason I bought an endurance <laughs> tank. <laughs> <laughs> right, so we've made it to the lunch stop on day two. Apart from the little fueling issue, it's all gone well. Well, in the mud, of course. This is the team. Well, some of them. Probably only about half of them here, yeah. Should be lunch in an auberge somewhere. Okay, so three quarters of the way through day two. Stopped at a checkpoint. Only the van's not here. It's supposed to be here to help us refuel. And not everybody's here anyway. So it's just a, a break before the, I think the last leg back to the hotel. Back at the hotel after the end of day two. Bike's running perfectly. Need to load to ride a bit better. It's um, had quite a bit of mud, as you can see. So it's uh, done the job. 